Lesson number seven. The air around us, the atmosphere, is made up of five layers. As you move away from the earth and into outer space, air becomes much less dense. The first layer, closest to the earth, is called the troposphere. This is the densest layer of air. Rising and falling air masses in this layer create weather. All weather occurs in this layer. The second layer is the stratosphere. The air is very stable here. Because of this, planes often fly at the border between the troposphere and the stratosphere. Weather balloons are found in the stratosphere. The third level is called the mesosphere. The mesosphere protects us from meteors which burn up in this layer. The fourth layer is the thermosphere. The largest of all layers, the farthest part of the thermosphere, is 530 miles from Earth. The space shuttle orbits in the thermosphere. The final layer is called the exosphere. This is where the atmosphere meets outer space. Remembering the order in a list can often be helped with the aid of a mnemonic device, a phrase built around the first letter or sound in each word. For example, the layers of the atmosphere can be remembered from the nearest to farthest using this phrase. Tremendous sounds make things exciting. Number three, which of the following organisms is a producer? A flower, a rabbit, or a bear? Number four, which organism above is an herbivore? A petunia, which is the flower, the rabbit, or the brown bear? Number five, which of the following would not be used to identify a mineral? Streak, cleavage, taste. Number six, choose the statement that best describes global warming. A, global warming occurs because of a hole in the ozone layer. B, global warming is the result of too many greenhouse gases building up in the atmosphere. C, global warming occurs when the greenhouse gases are used up and too much sunshine can reach the earth. Number seven, Susie decided to do an experiment to see if watching less TV will improve her grades. In this experiment, the amount of time watching TV is the independent or dependent variable, while Susie's school performance is the independent or dependent variable. Number eight, which of the following is not a part of the cycle pictured? Precipitation, evaporation, decomposition. Number nine, the hydrosphere contains all parts of the earth related to air, soil, water. Number 10, which of the following is a renewable source of energy? Coal, ethanol from corn, natural gas.